And I'm here with Dr. Peter Sharp from the Institute for Wildlife Studies, and we're discussing bald eagle restoration and conservation in California's Channel Islands region. And Peter, you make regular trips to the Channel Islands to monitor and study eagles, um, young eagles. Uh, you go out there, you band them just before they leave the nest permanently, and some get wing tags. And we're often asked about the wing tags since they are so conspicuous. Can you tell us a little bit about that tagging process? Specifically, I'm wondering, you know, how do you attach the tags? Um, do they impair the bird's <laughs> movements at all? And, and what purpose do the tags serve? Well, the purpose of the tags was to be able to identify them, especially uh, during the initial restoration efforts. This allowed us and other people to um, identify the birds from, from, the from a distance. So I can read one of those tags from, you know, three quarters of a mile away through a spotting scope. Um, so it just allowed us to get better information on the survival and movements of these birds. Uh, I've got a database of sightings of these birds, you know, uh, Alberta, Canada, British Columbia, Montana, just all over the place. So we have a, a good idea of where they've been moving to. Now the, the tag itself is made of a very lightweight, sturdy material. Um, because they're put on so early, the birds learn to fly with them. They treat them like a, a feather. Um, and <clears throat> what they do, um, the tag is folded over the, the leading edge of the, the wing. And then there's a, a round, um, it's a pig ear tag that is punctured through the patagium, which is a very, very thin piece of skin. Uh, no real nerves or blood vessels. Um, so that just holds it. Um, on the top and bottom of the wing. Uh, one of the benefits of our project with having all the, the, or most of the eagles banded is that we do get good information on the, the, the turnovers. Um, so we usually always know when there's a, uh, a mate turnover um, and know who that bird is, where it came from. <clears throat> so there's a lot more turnover than people think. Um, many of the the nest with unbanded birds. Um, if there's a turnover to a, another adult, uh, you often wouldn't even know that there had been a, a switch. 